maybe I should have let you go. Should have let you just walk on by. Never even said hi. So guys, I want to talk to you a little bit about villas in Bali. Now, a lot of people come here and they think that they can hire a villa for a reasonable price. And quite often you see these YouTubers that put info on and go, hey, I stayed in this beautiful villa and I paid um, 50 bucks a night. Well, that's sort of, that's a lot of crap. That doesn't happen. So um, with villas, they're, they're quite large. They're about four or five times the size of a hotel room. And if we look back in time, when the villas were first built here, they were just simply a collection of villas. There were six or eight villas. They had a security guy at the front gate, and that was about it. And then as time went by, they developed a little bit more because people wanted the bar and the spa. So some of the more recent ones became like 40 or 50 villas. They also have a bar, a spa, a gym. Um, and a large pool out the front so that you can either sit in your villa and have your privacy if you want it or you can go and sit around the pool and just so that you know a villa um, we're going to show you one shortly in this video but they're large they have one two three four five six bedrooms and for every bedroom they have there's also a bathroom so there is the privacy within the villa they also have a large lounge and um, they have a kitchen and of course the big pool so they are really spacious so you can see why they would be five times or so more than a hotel room because they're five times bigger so the one we're going to go and have a look at is called Mutiara and I really like it because it's the best of both worlds and it <clears throat> it works really well if you've got a group of people who are going away and some of them have got money to spare and they want to have the villa experience and they want to go in to a property with a pool and have a bit of privacy but there might be others in the group that are a little bit more cost conscious and they'd rather go into a hotel room so the good thing about Mutiara is that it has you walk in the front um, entrance to reception to the left you have all the villas and they're one and two and three bedroom and to the right you have the hotel area and that hotel area has restaurants and a bar, a spa, a gym and a huge pool. So if you're in the villa area you can wander over and meet your friends over there. Of course if you're, uh, so your friends can come and meet you as well but the villas are quite private so none of the other people in the complex can come into your villa. It's a walled complex, each villa is walled and it has a big gate in front of it and it's like your own little private pad with your own pool. So um, it's a great option, as I say, if you've got people that are going away, a group of people, and they've all got different budgets, they all want to stay at the same place, but some of them don't want to shell out the money relating to a villa. So we're going to go jump on a bike and we're going to go and have a look at it. It's called Mutiara. So let's go. Baby, I should let you go. Should have let you just walk on by Never even said hi No, no That we would never know Just how hard it feels To open up hearts To have to let them go so guys, I'm standing in reception at Mutiara, and as you can see, it's quite spacious. To one side of the property, we have the villas, which we're going to have a look at a little bit later on. And to the other side, we have the hotels, the hotel rooms. Now, I'm gonna take you, first of all, quickly to have a look at the restaurant and the bar. Then we're gonna go and have a look at a superior room and the hotel side. Now, there are quite a range of rooms over there, including family rooms that interconnect. But the room we're going to look at is a superior room. It's a twin room and it has twin beds in it. So let's go and have a look at the hotel side of Mutiara. Oh, God, a lot. 
to say But the words escape It never seems to be an easy way no, no. I hope and pray We at least get just a one more day Cause we decided to give this love a chance oh. Cause we got enough to try so now we're standing in front of one of the two bedroom villas. We've come into the ground. You might have noticed we came through a walled area. Um, we came through the front door. We've come into this garden area where there is a pool and this villa is a two bedroom villa. So I'm going to take you through it. On the lower level we have the kitchen, the lounge area, the bedroom and a large bathroom. And then when we go up the stairs to my right, we're going to see another bedroom and bathroom. So let's go and have a look at a two bedroom villa at Mutiara. What we're doing is right. Oh, I just need a little more time. Lord, to make sure that we're doing this right. Oh, I just need a little more time to make sure, yeah. What we're doing is right. Oh, I just need a little more time. Yeah, to make sure that we're doing this right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. And this is the last one we're going to have a look at. This is the three bedroom. Now, it's actually very similar and set up to the two bedroom that we've just looked at, but the only difference is still in the compound that we're in, but over to one of the corners, we have an additional standalone bedroom. And it, it doesn't look huge, but when we get inside, you'll find that it is quite spacious and it also has a generous bathroom. So let's go and have a look at the three bedroom option at Mutiara. So guys, that was Mutiara. I hope you enjoyed going through it. It's a really cool option because it offers either a villa side or a hotel side. And if you've got a group of people going away, particularly a family reunion or just a large group of people, there are always some that have got um, money. Money's not really a problem and they're quite happy to pay the additional cost and to go into a villa with its own pool. There might be people in the group that are a little bit more cash conscious and they would look at the hotel side of the property. But whichever one you choose as a group, you can still all gather around the pool or you can gather in the restaurant or around the bar or whatever. So um, 
it, it does offer endless options. So thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this. I'd really appreciate it if you would like, comment, and subscribe. And you can subscribe by pushing a little red button in the right-hand corner of your screen. By doing so, you'll encourage me to make more videos like this, and you'll help my channel grow. So thanks so much, and we'll see you in the next one. Ciao.